Oh my goodness. Thank you, Wanda. What the frick is it going to become? I want to see just like tentacles all over the place. What? <laughs> Yo. What's up, guys? It's Toronto Star Tube, and welcome back to Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. In the last episode, we took down one of the Titans, and it opened up the mysterious story of Arvin. He's up to something shady. I'm telling you. Well, we saw. He, he's factually up to something shady. Okay, before we go on, guys, go on and shank that like button. 4K likes, and we upload this again. Might be today, but this will be the fourth video. If not, tomorrow, and, you know, we go from there. But, uh, okay, now that we've started all of the... That is very loud. We've done all of the challenges. Look. No, zoom out. So if you look, we have finished everything shown in the trailers. Mela, the cloth, the first gym leader. Now it's all straight new content, and I'm so freaking excited. We can do... I'm thinking I want to do a Team Star one. Because I want to uncover the Team Star story. Is this a Team Star girl? No, that's a freaking... I'm sorry I judged your appearance. You're a Team Star, dude? Giacomo. Oh, if this man... How could I get there, though? I can't really cross the river. So I've got to get to something that I can approach. You know, I want to try getting over here. So there's a Team Star captain here. A weird-looking gym leader. Can I judge your appearance? Let's look at this man. What is this man thinking? What the freak is that? Why do you look like that? Why do I look like a... Okay, and then there's also... The Quaking Earth Titan. Frick, oh, we have that's what we're gonna do. That's what we're gonna do. So we have to head that way. If I go left from Mesa Goza, can I get across this river? I feel like I can. Okay, so I've already been here. This is where I did the grass gym leader. Let's see if I can cross the river. If not, then I might have to do something else. I mean, I could show you on the map. So right now, what we can do without crossing rivers and stuff is there's her, the Lavincia gym. She's like right here next to Mela. So I could take on her and then there's like another gym leader here. But I want to uncover the Team Star story. So F that for now. So what I want to do is go up here and try to cross this river. Problem is there's like so many cliffs. No, it's not possible to cross. Wait, wait, wait. I should try to make it here. I should try to make it there. I think if we make it there, we can, we can cross the river. Okay. We also got... Dash. 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 What? The? Look at me. Oh my goodness. Look at me. <laughs> what? The? What? Why do I look like that? Oh, it's fixed. Did you see me? I was dying. I was hitting my head everywhere. Am I recording? That's freaking hilarious. Mudbray. Okay, let's just. What the frick? We in a okay, I thought we hit a southern movie. What the frick is this? I found a cave. This ain't the cloth cave. I found a... Oh my god, it's the freaking... Uh... What do you even call those dra... What? Oh, I thought this was pouring. What do you call it? Pom-pom? Tutu. It's got a tutu. Okay. Um. Oh, it's more charcoal, friends. I'll let you live. Yeah, so, okay. Mela, right? If we do take on Team Star this episode, Mela, y'all freaking good. I'm gonna, I'm gonna handle y'all. We can put Rogers in the front, and uh, he'll handle everyone. Wait, stop! Oh my God, Rogers! Let the freaking. That's her real face, and there's something to her. I mean, she doesn't have. She's not a bad person. She raised the cadet, the coal cadet, whatever the Pokemon is. Oh my god, you're the Pokemon! You're the Pokemon that's part grass or something that I messed up on catching. Okay, let's catch it now. I thought it was the parent. I was so confused when it was normal flying. I knew it, I knew it. This thing looks like a three-stage Pokemon. What would it- well, imagine it becomes like a grass dragon. What the frick is this music? Man, I was just trying to kill some Mankeys. Paralyzed? Okay, that's my dog. Uh, she has a kind of heart. She's a good person. She took care of the Pokemon and all. So it makes you wonder what led her to Team Star. And then the rumor that Team Star is trying to do something in opposition to the school. I mean, that doesn't sound too dangerous. But you never know what it means when it's opposition to the school. 
Maybe it's like a huge like evil plan. But they also confirmed there's like a boss for team Caspa Kid. Spicy pepper Pokemon. What? The more sunlight this Pokemon bathes and the more spicy chemicals are produced by his body. And thus the spicer it becomes. Okay, you're the spice girl. What's what's one of the spice? Your chick spice. Brand new spice. Chick Spice. This is worth the nickname for a Pokemon I will certainly add to the party. I should add you to the party. Get your get your face away. Okay. Leave me alone. I wanna Look at that. Two entries pa Oh my god, does Cloth not evolve? Did you see that? It's entry was right beside Cloth. So it's like it don't evolve. Do you suck? Just chase the Mankey and kill it. Oh, we're not getting enough experience for this. Let's just keep going. So, what way were we on? We have to follow the path. Okay. We are uh, we are going this way. We're following the path. Um, Ignore them. What is that? A big freaking flower. Famfi? Famfi, you have some explaining to do. <laughs> Famfi, you have a... Oh my goodness, Famfi. Those Famfis are descendants of some hectic things. Oh, it's a TM. I really feel like that, that Casper kid, it evolves twice. I might have to check it out. I just need this Wiglet to evolve and then my life will be in order. Like, she don't gotta evolve the same level as Diglett. That makes sense, but... Please... Oh my... Fr I forgot we have a freaking tentacle on our party. Who made this? I'm gonna... I'm gonna... Uh, I feel like that's the only two regional fakes. Because I feel like if they introduce too many, they'll think it's confusing. So, one is all I thought they would do, but two? It's probably just those two. And Kanto Pokemon makes sense. Okay. Uh, I don't want to use you. I want to use Trunkus, who's level 32. Man might evolve. Level 36, level 33. They sound like level C could evolve. Okay, help has arrived. Let's do this. 500 LP just for talking to the den. Um, what is this Pokemon? What is this thing? Do I know this Pokemon? Oh, it's Barboach! <laughs> Did I scream in the mic? That's so unexpected. I'm like, oh, what is this intricate design? It's a Barboach with bug antenna. What the frick, Barboach? Come back! So if someone uses a grass move on the Barboach, man turns bug. Well, he'll show you. Okay, let's just catch it real quick. Okay, we got some good XP candies. Okay, okay. Freaking one star dens. They there were there ever such things as a one star den? In 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 the oh my freaking face cam, can you? Maybe I have to do this. There we go. Were there ever such things as a one star den? No, I know who you are. In like sun and uh, sword and shield? Freaking one star I get no nothing for these. So I have I have something interesting because when I edited the last episode I noticed when Arvin was making his food, he said Oh, he'll be able to eat some too. And I said in the episode, who the frick is he? And I realized he is whatever that, whatever he brought out. He has some weird Pokemon. I'm, I'm, I'm freaking really curious. I have no idea what the Pokemon could be, okay? Level 26. Okay, we have XP. It's evolving! Oh my goodness. Thank you, Wanda. I'm glad we're getting this on film. The world sound phone, I mean, what the frick is it gonna become? I wanna see just like tentacles all over the place. What? <laughs> Yo! Wait, it's actually Wug Tree. That makes no sense. It still looks like Diglett. Why this man got a crooked neck? Oh my god, it's still Wug. I. So that freaking Toad Cool is gonna evolve into Toad Cruel for real, bro. This is this is a hundred percent in the. I mean, we know this, but you know, people will be getting technical. It's a hundred percent just like regional forms. It's essentially a regional form of Diglett. They had no. I want to read it, man. Oh my god, that design is sick, though. I'm a fan. Okay, the XP candies. I'm gonna use these. Can we get a two in one? I'm gonna use these on tentacles. So level 26. Uh, if I can get you to 26, maybe you'll evolve too. 
It makes sense. If you evolved certain ways like Diglett, you would develop the same tendency that, you know, of the Diglets working together and evolving together. But unbelievable. That's such a cool design. Okay, I have to freaking see your Pokedex entry. Man, maybe we should take F that. We're taking on a Titan. I need to see what Arvin I need to see what Arvin is up to. We're doing a Titan. Um, give me my freaking Pokedex. Everything is, is so different in this game. Okay, Pokedex. Um Oh, it's actually Vlog Trio. What the frick? It appear it has a vicious temperament contrary to what its appearance may suggest. Are you kidding me? It's vicious? That's creepy. It warps its long bodies around prey, then drags the prey into its den. Are you kidding me? That is not a... That is no Doug Trio of mine. I don't even know this man. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, stop it. Stop it, Tutu. Wait a second. I... Give me the... Let this man follow me. I need to see this man. Okay, that's suspicious. You can't be a moving den. What the hell? just you again okay that was a sick evolution okay we made it to a new pokemon center let's go which i don't know how to oh that's how you jog okay figure it out it's just l3 you arrived at your destination i guess i could buy tms what tms can i buy I... can it show me the new ones what's what's all this oh it's it's typing so fire flame charge Thunder Fang. Oh, I think it's Thunder. Okay, F this. I have no freaking materials. I gotta play the game for much longer. Freaking what? Now that I have Wug Trio, <laughs> I can't believe it. That was the one name I was certain it wouldn't be. But it freaking is. That is insane. Wait, stop. Okay, go handle him. No, Mankey. Don't you dare. That's like a freaking squirrel running in the road. Okay, so where do we want to go from here? From here, we can cross the bridge. <gasps> That's it. I'm so stupid. There's a bridge. We can freaking go. We can freaking go there. I think we're going to do another uh, Titan. We're going to do a freaking Titan this episode. I have to. I have to see what Arvin's story leads to. If I win, I got a freaking fight you for to win. Stupid. Might be stupid out here. Is it freaking Rookity? Oh, who? It's Nimona. I was just speaking about you, suspicious Volo. Yo, Damo. So from what I gather, it seems like the open open sky titan lives somewhere up this mountain. But there's all these crazy boulders raining down from the mountain too. It's going to be a little tricky to stand around and look for the titan while dodging all those. I think you'll be sent flying if you get hit by a falling boulder. Or maybe you could power your way through atop that brute of yours. Falling boulders? What is this, Zelda? What is that? A giant staircase. I should check that out. These towers? It's a freaking windmill. Do windmills have these kind of staircases? What about these windmills? We can't, we can't climb them? It's a little sad. They'll never have a visitor get cried on. Freaking goofy lizard. Oh my goodness, this is dangerous. I'm gonna fall off. <laughs> Two billion percent. Two billion. Okay. Okay. It's, it's so dangerous. Where's, where's Gimmigol? Oh, I almost freaking did it. Gimmigol? What the frick? There's... It's nothing. Can I die? Okay, let's die. You ready? Okay. I thought I'd get hit by the wind. What did I climb that for? Why are there stairs there? I've been tricked. Oh! What the frick is that? Are you kidding me? Am I playing Pokemon or Zelda? This is crazy. Enjoy picnicking. I wish to die. Come and get me. Oh, the... Yo! What is that? A giant vulture? Is it? That's the Titan? He dropping like... Like a Mario villain. He dropping these boulders. I will confront death. Come and get me. If only I could fly. Will you come down? I wonder what happens if I get hit by these. Stop it. Ow! I'm squished. Oh, okay. Maybe if I get hit too many times, I get sent down. Hey, we're... Okay, that's very painful. What are you, a rock-type bird? Arvin? Oh my goodness, it's gonna eat me. It's gonna steal me. Come and get me, you flamingo. 
Ew. What the frick you got there? A stork? Bombard. Bombardier. A bombarding. Oh my god. Oh, we get in story, boys. We get in story. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's terrestrialize. I don't know what your typing is. I guess you're... What if it's like... Dark Flying Rock. I think it's a, one of the two of those three. Let's go. I just need a bit more Arvin story and then I'll hop on a Team Star. I love that you can freaking pick your path, man. This, I, I hope... I hope this game does well and they continue this for future games. I don't want to go back to like forced direction. Sometimes it's needed, but it's, it's sick. It's sick. It's sick. So what? Like, it, oh, it's the plot that the baby is in. Oh, but instead of babies, it's tossing boulders on people. Where are you going? Drugs? Hey, yo. Let's see. It's probably Sour Sweet Mi Sour Mystica. The Titan Bombardier began eating something. My boy Volo Arvin. Damn, well, you managed to get to the Titan somehow, huh? Yes, sir. So that's the Open Sky Titan. I have to pay close attention to his dialogue because he, he, he slips things. Wait, is this Titan what's been dropping all those boulders? I was lucky enough to be able to sneak up here because it had all its attention on you, little bud. It looks like it's trying to power itself up, like with some kind of mystical meal power or something. We've seen this, you dummy! It's eating the herbs. Thank you for returning so... <laughs> so beautifully. <laughs> oh, shoot. You know, I actually like that design. It's a it's a story like would it's supposed to carry Knackly? Oh, I know that Pokemon. Let's see what can I see your typing? I can't. Trying to drop rocks on folks is dangerous. Let's give this thing a good taste of defeat. So weird. I was starting to get under the impression that the Titans would be where we found like you know, the, the ancient Gonfan. But it may be not. So now I'm, I'm curious what the other Titans are. Maybe like the last Titan is Don Fan or something. So it's like it's like Clop was harder than this one. Maybe the order is you do this one first. Are you okay? I should catch you. You're gonna freaking. I feel like it just died. The Titan Bombardier. Junchi is 24. Is that evolution? Junchi, my dog. Okay, not really. I was anticipating the evolution. Yes, way to go, Tamu. Looks like we don't have to worry about any more falling boulders on us now, huh? You sound. Wait, who? What the frick? Oh, there has to be more. Okay, this is my theory. How could the? What are the herbs growing from? There's something in you. If not just energy, there's something like under the ground that Arvin sends out something. Artifact, anything. If Pokemon, like if the Dawn Find came from the past, what if it's somewhere here, it's hidden? A connection, you know? Maybe people who anticipated Dawn Find coming to the future or something. I don't know. I, I need to see it. I need to see what freaking Arvin is up to. Will I ever be able to meet Sada? If we're lucky, there'll be another herb here. Okay, so the last one was sweet. I'm gonna see if this is like sour or something. Don't- it's freaking a uh, freaking I'm in front of you. Don't be- Where could it be? Green. It must be sour. Sour apples. And talk about the book. This is one of the herbs, make no mistake. Yo, I might be able to climb cliffs now. Bitter? That's the same thing, isn't it? I don't think so. Woohoo, we did it. Thanks, Tamo. Now let's see. What does this book have to say? This is the screenshot. Okay. Bitter herb mess mystica gets your blood flowing. Boost the immune system, or so it says. But that's not what he's gathering them for. He's an, He really is a cook, but this is a front. If I can just slip this into a tasty sandwich and get him to eat some. 
He said it again. Wait! Is he talking about me? He wants me to eat? Is, it, is he drugging me? But... But... Because he, I haven't seen him eat his sandwich. He saved his sandwich. He, the, he gave me half of it? No, but I eventually probably ate my half. Okay, no, no, he's not drugging me. <laughs> he's he wants to give it to his Pokemon. That's that's the he. Whatever the mysterious Pokemon is. But what are we waiting for, Tamil? It's time to dig in. Let me whip something up for us. You gotta show me this time. You gotta show me. You're Hayahuacha. And Bob is your uncle. Here you go, my special whimsical herb filled super sandwich. It comes with a side of Titan badge, okay? Two Titan badges and two gym badges. Why would I eat that? It probably tastes bitter. That ain't a devil fruit. I have no benefits to gain from, well, immune system, fine. Let's check his dialogue. I guess. <laughs> it's freaking adorable. Come on, you again. <laughs> sniff, sniff. Do you want to give your sandwich? It's interesting because if you choose to do this the first time, sec as your first one, second, third, fourth, I feel like Arvin says different things, right? So it's cool. I'm proud of Game Freak. I can't say this is mine, not to cry on. Giants. <laughs> is he trying to say thanks or something? Well, good thing I made extra. You're helping me out a whole bunch with the hard stuff, so it's only fair that you get more. I definitely absolutely did not make extra so that Karada could have a sandwich, okay? What you got against him? He, he's so mad at Karada and he always was. You see his reaction when he first... Why do you need... You don't even swim. This, you know, your thing? It's just like, it's, it just makes you float. Did it grow stronger again? I did. Look how close I am to your face. Man, these Herba Mystica really do pack a punch, don't they? How come I don't feel anything? Eat it! Eat the other one! I mean, they better, or else I'm really up the creek. Yes! Eat it! Please. Please! Don't you dare touch that! This isn't- that isn't for you! You Volo. See? That was his true... This, that was his truth. That's him. Uh-oh. Sorry. I, I shouldn't have shouted like that. I guess I should at least tell you the full story, Tamo. You gonna be honest with me? No way. Who could it be? Watch it be freaking Cyclizer and I just be like... But you see the way he ducked, he he uh, went on one knee? Wasn't it like a little respectful? Like, what, what were you gonna send it a, a Hariyama when you do that? Come on up, bud. Well, let's see. Well, he's being honest. He's not hiding. Let's go. Whoa. This is my boss, Tiff. <laughs> What's good? Are you LeChonk or are you not? Oh my god, it's sick, isn't it? This is my boss, Stiff, my partner. Oh yeah, you know it, right? Oh my god, it's sick. I'm sorry, Arvin. Wow, I thought this man was shady. He yelled because he's like, bro, I need the sandwich for my dog. Literally. Here you go, bud. Eat up. This sandwich should help you feel better. Slowly now. Take your time. This is why he wants to gather it. He wants to find every herb, hoping one of them can save it? Small bites are fine. Just chew nice and slow. It's Fenrir all over again. My buddy here was hurt pretty bad a while ago. Real bad, in fact. He never really recovered. This is a valid question. Why don't potions work? 
Nothing seems to help. Not potions, not Pokemon centers, nothing. My boss, Stiff. Here is the only thing in the world I care about. The only thing. So I promised that I'd make him better, whatever it takes. Well, you care about your mom because you you're saying something about your mom's goals. Hmm. I searched online, I read books, I looked all over and tried every cure and remedy I could find. But nothing really worked, I'd almost given up hope. That's when I found out about the Herba Mystica. What the frick is this? You've done your research! What am I, freaking the professor? What is the book? I found it in my mom's lab. Why does your Flintstones mother have a lab? Oh my goodness. Gibbo Eevee, some freaking businessman. So when the Pokemon eat it, they get super strong. Uh, we have herbs, leaves, twigs. That looks like a ginger and stuff. Oh, Area Zero was home to the wondrous herbs that instantly impart vigor when eaten. We dubbed them Herba Mystica. These herbs are from Area Zero, essentially. And attempted to grow some in areas around Paldea. However, before we could harvest, the herbs were eaten by Pokemon, which in turn grew large and strong. We call these Titan Pokemon. Sada, you did this. So Sada took the herbs from the the foggy area and caused these Titans. It's this book full of crazy stories and legends and things, stuff nobody'd usually believe. But I believe it. I think what it says is true. And according to this book, eating all five Herba Mystica can cure anything that ails you. Case in point, Mazda Bo Maz Mabostiff's paws are cold as ice. Were cold as ice before he ate that last herb. But they've warmed up a little now. I'm sure they have. Oh, you done eating, bud? was blind? Hey, Master B, my, my, my boss, did you, you can see? Are your eyes open? Yes, I did it. Hey, yo, he got his own car ride on. He's, he's bringing back his potential too. It's been so long since he was able to open his eyes. I was so worried. Sniff, oh man, I, I'm so glad. Well, you freaking whine and sniff on him. Uh, look at him. Those fiery orange little eyes. Hard to even tell if they're open or not, but I know the difference. Yeah, I couldn't tell. The power of these herbs is amazing. I knew the book wasn't lying. I'm gonna bring my, my, my bow Steve back to full health, I swear it. Oh my god, did Coridon injure him? That's why he's, he, 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 he hates Coridon. Oh my frick, that's what happened. Uh, oh yeah, so that's my story. Three herbs to go, let's find him together. Agia, Agia. Was it Coridon? His mom is Shane. I've I've changed the target. His mom had the book. I feel like he has the only copy of that book because he stole it from his mom. The mom don't even show up in person. She just video calls um Clay, Cleve, Clav, Cl Clive. You know the prince, the headmaster. Clavel. She, I don't, if she did pop up in this time period, she's just been messing up the world. She's like, okay, let me plant these things everywhere. Then she causes a giant Pokemon to appear. She's researching stuff. If, the, if let's say she's from the past and she's trying to go back to her time. Maybe she's caught, maybe she caused like the freaking Dawn fan to be pulled from its time. Let's see. Rototototo, Sada. Tell me about my new friend. I detect that Coridon has regained more of its original power. While riding upon it, it seems you should be able to move across water. I'd be so pissed if the freaking What's his name? If Turo called me like this. I'll block him. I'm relying on you to continue taking care of Coridon. She knows Coridon too. You know? It's a little... I feel like... I feel like she's suspicious. Is there some benefit to me taking care of it? Like, Coridon is, like, like uh, super reckless. But if uh, if you're someone who cares about, then you can tame it. 
and like no one's been able to tame it before or something okay anyhow we freaking we did it we did it okay let's freaking take on gym leader too we got this oh no this man this is what we're doing we're freaking going there we're going there we're doing this um set his destination starfall street this might be a hard freaking boss but we're gonna do it hey yo hit me with that mesper cave i bet you i can't even climb this Frick, you can do it, Cory in the house. You kidding me? This ain't a cliff. I can climb this. Oh, nice. Where did the item go? Are you kidding me? There was an item on this. Is that a weedle? What is that? Oh my goodness, it's a baby Tapu Bulu. What the f Hello? What the? <laughs> Yo! Who gave you that? This is outrageous. Who gave you that? Give me fight the Bulu. An electric tad ball. An electric levitating Pokemon that roams over lakes. I didn't mean to kill you, Bella Bolts. How you thought I wouldn't notice? Whoa, Basculin. Its eyes just look weird. Okay, I mean, if I find him again, I'll freaking catch him. Are there any more? Oh, frick. They're right here. Let's get him. Don Fan, I'm on to you next. You, you, you have to be Bella Bolts, right? Tad Bob, you're Bella Bolts. Okay, well, yawn, and then we'll throw a freaking great ball. We're gonna go to freaking Team Star as well. The gym leaders, we have two. Maybe we'll do... We'll do them later, bro. After gym leaders. But next time we do a freaking gym battle, Namona's gonna fight us. And Namona's freaking crazy, bro. Like, my goodness. She's already champion rank. I can't get over that. Okay, bro. You act like... You act like people want you. You can lit Those are literally Bella Boat's eyes. <laughs> All it does is get a bigger body, but it keeps the exact same freaking face. He's caught. Easily. That's the strat, man. Put a Pokemon to sleep and you can catch it at full health. Okay, let's get going, Quarry. Tadbulb mucus, bruh. Tadbulb shakes its tail to generate electricity. If it senses danger, it will make its head blink on and off. Uh, can I see that in action? I'll call you... Ta... Taiyui. Yeah, bro. You're gonna love that name. I'm like cursing all these Pokemon when they catch him. Okay, so... Maybe it could evolve twice. And Bellabolt better not be that twice evolved form. Um, this is not the way. This is not the way, but something might be here. Let's give it a check. Are you kidding me? What the frick is this for? I wish to jump. This man, he... Okay, so I feel like... Ne what? Are you... Are you serious, Karan? I'm picking up the item! What den is this? Who the frick do you think you are? What are you, a rocket beetle? Kill the sucker! Where are you going? He's the evolved form of that nymph. Let's see what his name is. <laughs> Matt's go Wait, what is this? Fighting? Oh, giant... Fist. Is that a, a Nurse Choi freaking? Are you wearing? Are you wearing a freaking Nurse Choi hat? Low kicks. You. That sounds like you're already a fighting type. Oh, I gotta kill you. Okay. Oh shoot! Fight it. This might be a problem. Damn. Okay. That's not much damage at all. 
Oh, let's go. Come on. What you mean? What you mean? Lunge? Okay. And parahax? Nah, no parahax here. I don't get paralyzed. You watch a new mode? What is that? I think it is. It is. It's that bug we saw earlier. It's freaking evolved. I need to get more Great Balls. I guess I could have used the Net Ball. These freaking humanoid Pokemon. Remember the Tarantula? I can't get over it freaking just wandering. Oh, it's disgusting. That scared the freaking crap out of me. Oh my goodness. Junchi! What level is Junchi? 24 Toads? Cool. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is freaking fake. It must be fake. It must be fake. Of all the Pokemon, it was really tentacle. I thought he was evolving. When it decides to fight all out, it stands on its previously folded legs to enter showdown mode. Okay, it neutralizes its enemies in short order. Order. Okay, I'll call you... Um, load Rim. You're gonna love it. You're gonna love going to school with that name. No, 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 Rim. You, ooh! It's freaking coming together. I'm just messing around. That's a freaking rock. Okay. Well, I've completely abandoned the path that was. Let's die! Let's go, baby! Koradon, how dare you land safely? So where am I now? <laughs> I'm getting closer. Uh, what are all these Pokemon here? Uh, a dark den. I can handle that. Wait. What is that? What's the tutu? Fighting types are the best. I will never fight a trainer. Avoid the trainers in its hard mode. It's actually really fun. Mud brazen stuff. Okay. We're going the right way. Uh, should I put someone else in the front? So, Chonkus, my Foy Coco evolution. I don't remember the name. It's like Karabarar. He is... See, it's that Pokemon evolved. He's level 33? He... Karidon! You got scared of a bug and cling to the cliff? Outrageous. You know, I want the auto-heal to auto-heal your statuses, too. I feel like that would be good. What is it even auto healing with? Okay, come on. Like I have, to, I have, I have a good amount of super potion. Okay. Level thirty two. Okay, it's not thirty three. It's thirty two. So let us see. Full heal. Well, there's the Pokemon Center, so I don't really got a auto heal. Who's here? Numo. Well, now, what could Numo be doing here? Of all... It's over. Oh, it's just a swamp blue. Okay, it's not over. Life is still good. It's terrifying, man. Wait, is that a Palmy evolution? That's a freaking Palmy evolution. Palmo! Don't think I don't know the difference. I'm a genius. Get away. Been having some nice battles. I refuse- No! Refuse to talk- Go right on! Go right on, that's not- No! Listen! Talk to the joy! Thank you. Okay. So, we're gonna deal with one of the Team Star... Bosses. Dark type boss. So it might be Palmy's fight here. Uh, Palmy and Foy Coco, all of them- We might freaking evolve. If Palmy evolve again, Palmy gonna evolve too. And hopefully, hopefully, this freaking fake tentacle evolves. The freaking green thing? What is it called? Casper Kid? It looks like a like a green bagon. Keeps tripping me out. Um, where the frick did I just see the flags? They're just indicating to me that it's nearby. Okay, let's take our right right here. Let's go. How you doing, Mudbray? Oh my god, it's Casanova. Clavel, get off my face!
Are you kidding me, Clavo? Oh! <laughs> My goodness. You just... Did you add glasses to your disguise? Hi, it's you, Demo. Clive? Yep, it's me, Clive. The normal again. <laughs> Oh my goodness, the normal academy student. Anyway, Tamil, I owe you one. Thanks to you, I've been accepted into Operation Starfall. What is your goal here, Zhao Man? Why did you join? <laughs> What's your endgame? I need answers, that's all. How do I resolve this situation with Team Star? And what's causing its members' odd behavior? What you mean? Team Star is the subject of more than a few nasty rumors. S Swirling around the academy, you know. Some say their bullying has caused a worrying number of students to drop out of school. Others say they're holed up in their bases, plotting to cause trouble for the academy. But these are rumors. What matter? The matter I am directly confronted with is something else. I'm talking about Team Star's persistent truancy. They've been skipping class for a while now. Five of them in particular, the so-called bosses of Team Star, haven't so much as set foot inside a classroom for over a year. And it seems the team's rank and file have recently started stirring up mischief as well. So he wants to know what's making them not even come to school. That's odd. Well, that's why I took it upon myself to issue a direct order to Team Star to disband. I informed them. <laughs> Damn, <laughs> I informed them that should they refuse, I would have no choice but to expel all students affiliated with their team. But he doesn't want to do that, right? He still believes in them. But I'm afraid there's been no response, and the deadline I set for them to make their choice between dissolution or expulsion is nigh upon us. So you see, when I overheard you talking on the phone to Cassiopeia, I couldn't have come... <laughs> Cassiopeia, I couldn't have come at a more crucial time. Here she is! It's, it's Casanova. Can you hear me? Erk. Whisper, whisper. Another time then. Be careful. What the frick? This is for you too. You know she knew you were here. I see you're coming up to one of Team Star's bases. Was there someone with you just now? I wish to tell the truth. <laughs> it's just me. Damn, this game has you lying? Well, be warned that Team Star will have its guard up after losing one boss to already. This base won't go down as easily as the last one. Proceed with extreme caution. I'll be in touch. Freaking hacker. They made an actual hacker in this game. You didn't hack my phone. Namona gave you... What if it's Gita? But why would Gita need my help? She could fart all of these Team Star members away. I wish I hadn't said that. <laughs> I have more respect for Gita than that. Uh, what's good, uh, Dark Man? Dark Type Trainer Man? Whoa, whoa, hold it, you- Bro, it's freezing! Um, up ahead's the base of the Team Star's Dark Crew. You may know us as the Sagan Squad. Yup, and we don't take too kindly to random kids snuffing around our turf. Sorry, but if you don't turn yourself around here, amigo, we'll have to send you packing. Wait, hold up. Just going on a hunch here, but are you that Damo kid? Wow, this is the first game where your reputation makes sense. And like, you know how uh, Steven sends you to fight Kyogre and your reputation don't make sense? Characters recognizing you? In this game, I feel like it'll, it, it makes sense. And by the time we get to the climax, it'll make sense. You know, that piece of work we're out to get for declaring war on Team Star? Maybe I am. Maybe I am, he says, cool as a cucumber. Honesty's not always the best policy, you know. Uh, you know what? Doesn't matter who you are. You're not getting through. Buzz off or get thrashed by me in battle, kid. What'll it be? <laughs> I'll get out of your hair. <laughs> yeah, sassy kids like you are the worst. She's back to speed running the milk challenge. My goodness, you got VR glasses on, farming simulator. <laughs> That's it, prepare to get stumped into the dirt. I will summon the cold breeze on you. You'll be freezing. All right, let's see what level your Pokemon are. Merkle, you don't gotta work so hard you can land. I'm gonna destroy this base with Pommy. What's also cool about Team Starius here is I really hope they expand this stuff. Like, they carry this stuff on a future Pokemon games, but if you notice, like, 
you know, Team Rocket, Team Lack and all, they start to have the same Pokemon, you know, Skuntank, Golbat or whatever. But here, they can keep changing it up. So now these are going to be all Dark Trainers. Why did such a sassy kid have to be so strong? I think I was strong and then I became sassy. God, how the heck could I lose? Back to farming challenge. Look, whatever. It's your problem now. Fin oh, it's her again. Finish up here, would you, bud? Okay, thanks. Hasta la V-star. Hasta la V-star. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> I can't tell who's talking. She's new to the team, you know. Might have to have a little chat with her about that attitude. Uh, well, I'm going to go into the base now and give the rest of the squad the heads up. He's not even going to fight me. You got to fight me, man. Okay, I'll still have star sure. And we got freaking robots in this game. Okay, Casanova. I see you took care of the guards. Nice work. Unbelievable. Now, hold up in that base is Team Star's dark crew, the Se Segin squad. Their boss, Giacomo. Uh, pretty much runs the whole of Team Star. And he also produced that wild soundtrack of theirs himself. Why is Yuri telling me this? What the? This is vital information. You're gonna have to know this. He's a sharp guy. Even our declaration of war won't have him ruffled in the slightest. Why am I fighting him right now? His plan is probably to wear you down with a wave of grunts and finish you off himself. No use trying to outthink strategic types like him. Bring him down with a head-on attack. Just keep on defeating as many Pokemon as you can. Oh, so no limit. I just have to survive. Okay, they change it up. They change it up. This is a good episode. Okay, so let's see. Is my team... My team's... My team solid. Uh, my big three are gonna be... Um, change position. My big three are gonna be Cheek Me. Uh, Chunkus. And... My goodness. Oh, Rogers. No, no, no. Is there a better way to... Stop it! God, there must be a... Oh. No, wait, what's happened here? Oh, Cheek Me. Okay, these are my three I'm gonna go in with. Uh, Cheek Me's kinda weak, but I think it'll be fine. Let's go. Let's go, who's that? West Province, Area 1. Ghastly looking. Super, super smooth. Ghastly, I, I, I want like the, I want to lick the, the ghostly part. It looks, okay, well. Maybe someone gets why I said that. It look, it's so like. It's so, it's so bright and vibrant. <laughs> Thank goodness you can't see my face. What the frick, Mankey's got a life. I'm, I'm not even going the. Oh, I'm going the right way. Dash, dash, my dogs, dash. Let's jump. Just kidding. What the frick? Did I really? What the heck is that? Is that freaking? It's like Po Town. I'm trying to get through here. But I've got to go through here. Okay, you know what? Set his destination. What? That's it. I will jump over if you don't... I will do a jump and... Ju I will do this! Yes! No! But it was so smart! It was so smart. I, I did it. I did it. If I see Wiglets... Stone Turner. Oh my god, I'm in a new country. What type of Pokemon is that? Please. Oh my god, look at this desert. What is that? What the frick? It's just a tree. Calm your bum. Um, I'm sorry that I... Uh, I'm sorry that I got far. Harvin? Hey, damn, apparently this desert is home to the Quaking Earth Titan. Speaking of which, the ground's been shaking off and on and irk, making me feel a bit sick. Sorry, I'm just gonna sit down and rest a little before I get back to Titan hunting. You're getting... Or is that... Should I be concerned? Or, like, he's just... He's just getting, like, motion sick from it. Okay, I'm gonna check that out. But, uh, I was kind of in the... <laughs> I was kind of doing something. It's just like a... I think it's just a... A wild Terra Pokemon, I'm sure. Well, let's see. Is that Fairy? It is Fairy. I don't really have a way to fight Fairy, but I could lead Chonkus and see what Bonk is. Okay, Chonkus. Who it is? Don't you dare with your with your freaking like cartoon feet. 
I will challenge it alone. This should be fast. Maybe the maybe the raids only go up to like three star or something. Cause I, I have not found like a freaking two star even. Let alone like four or five stars. Whoa! That's the that's the fairy Nice. All the crowns are good. That's the fairy crown. Okay, get your whole face dead. He's done for. Uh, should I catch it? Is a fairy type 1 very beneficial? Really? I can't believe it. He's standing on those. <laughs> it's so weird to me. Okay. I didn't buy more grape balls. I forgot. Okay. See, I got no good XP candy either. Can't be doing these. I gotta get back up the cliff. Clavo, please. I'll pay you 27 life points the freaking music wait the flaps that fall from it I already read this sizzle slow silly cobra oh my god that's the quaking earth titan F a team star say it with me now F a team star that's why you knocked me off that cliff you stupid Where's the... There! You knocked me off! Oh my goodness, it's happening! Wait, wait, he fell asleep, but he's stuck! Oh my god, he's inside! Um... Yo! What the frick is that? He's playing basketball! You gotta stop that! Are you Baby Cloth? Oh no, I wanna... My name Reller. That's what he said to me just now. She. Um. What? Where, where did you get that ball from? You rolling the dirt, or you you like you're like a bee? You've been making that for a while now. Uh, I don't think the first ball will work, but we'll try just in case. That's the Titan. Like this is so amazing, right? I had a goal in mind. I fell off, and there I'm doing other parts of the game. It's like a. I don't know if you could. Oh, that's just so sick. Render this uh, Pokemon creates mud balls by mixing sand and dirt with psychic energy. D where did that come from? He's not even a psychic type. It treasures its mud ball more than its own life. I will call you relish because you relish everything. Is that is that how you spell relish? Or is that the topping? A bug psychic type possibly, but we have Orbeetle. He evolves. He freaking evolves. Your freaking oh my god, its spikes are up. Who that boy? Who that boy? What the frick is? Okay. Oh my goodness. Um, I will kill them all with my Wanda. Kill him. You can do it. Drag him into your prey. Why did you fight me? Why did you fight me? You have no idea the mistakes you've made. Please. Yeah! Yeah! Beat him up! Beat up the children! Piss the Dawn fan off. It's not like a big Dawn fan will come for me. Goodness! He's like the size of 17 Dawn fan. Where you going? Where you going? The house is chasing... Please be Tumbleweed. Please be Tumbleweed. Please be Tumbleweed. It's not Tumbleweed. How many people have fallen to this? What the frick? Dawnfan, stay away! It ate a freaking Pampy! How many humans have wandered into the desert and died to this? A couple tears of, I'm shedding for this. What? Don't you dare use that. Okay, I will go and go into Chunkus. We will put you to sleep. We will catch you. I will confront the father of the Dawnfan. This, this, this Dawn fan is gonna make Arvin, it's gonna make Arvin talk. This Dawn fan will make Arvin talk. He's gonna, uh, just yawn. I don't want to risk killing him. This is literally this, the case of Paridon, this Dawn fan right here. I can't believe Pokemon did it. 
like I mean I've said this a few times during my playthroughs but the the more recent time I said it was when I played Legends Arceus I always wanted them to kind of like normalize legendary Pokemon ever since regional variants came out an example I gave was like a, a legendary Ninetales a ghost Ninetales that's a legend right they freaking did it with these this is a legendary Dawn fan from its primal times you know just like primal Groudon and all this this was the savage Dawn fan from back then is what I think so far but we have to see what, what actually happened Okay, I got a crit crap. Crit 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 crap? How do you say it? Crit crap. Uh, Jun Chi. Cheekme wants to learn Thunder Wave. This is very beneficial. I'll get rid of Thunder Shock, bro. I'm not a special attacker. I need to learn something else. Brambin. A grass ghost. A soul unable to move on to the afterlife was blown away by the wind until it got tangled up with dry grass and became a po- What the frick? <laughs> this turned into a comedy. <laughs> what the hell? I will name you appropriately. Brassius. Uh, get, get away from me. I got Brassius. Oh, maybe he only appears at nighttime. I bet the like, different Pokemon. Who touched me? This is freaking chaos. All I want is for no one to touch me. Hold on, do something. What is this den? It is water? How do I fight water dens? I don't... Oh, I just got rid of Thundershot, but it wasn't that good. I could use Junchi. But do I have... Oh, I have Mega Drain. Okay, Junchi. This is your moment to turn into a Wug Trio. No, that's not what you become. Oh my god, it's Wuglet. What's it? Wuglet, right? This is your chance to become Toad's Cruel. I can't believe its name is really Wug Trio. That is some wild stuff. Oh, Ice! Ice is just a freaking one snowflake. What the hell? All these Wiglets staring at me. What the? Yo! In my movie theater? The Wiglets music video here. Rattled? It looks like a nurse wiglet once again. It was ice? This is what I'm four times weak to. I'm freaking dead. Someone stun him, please. Oh no. Thank you, thank you. Please, for some reason, don't use ice moves on me. Wiglet disappeared somewhere. Okay, XP candy still obtained. Maybe after you beat enough raids, they start to level up. That could be the case, too. Leave me alone. I'm gonna feed all these candies. Are you... Pr are you proud of me, Southern movie Don fan? Sasuke's theme Don fan? Where'd he go? Don fan! Sorry, that hurt your ears. I'll do it again. This is your fault, Piers. Whatever the team's... Look, what's his name? Oh, baby, he's about to be behind me. We hide from the Dawn fan. Imagine, imagine how, oh, they should do it. One of these should be like predator mode. So you have to like hide and it sees you and starts chasing you. You gotta like hide behind these and stuff. Um, I really don't know where it went. I'm like on it. What the frick is that? Okay. Um, Dom fan, I'm kind of scared, bro. He looked kind of peaceful, but remember, a researcher found him and he was like messing them up. So, you know, as we know so far, Sada has nothing to do with the Dom fan. All she has to do is with the Mystica herb that she planted in these. Where did it go? Wasn't something here? How come every time I blink, stuff disappears? I can't freaking see. I'm not going to any shiny spots ever again. Don't you come out right now or you're... You're grounded. Oh, whatever, man. I'm gonna go in the bag. We're gonna feed the wiglet. Oh, yes. Wait, let's go back. 
six small XP can not Wiglet, the tent to school. <laughs> uh, six of these, okay. Twenty six sounds like the level. So please. Oh my goodness, it hit it. Please evolve. Please evolve. What the frick is your problem? I asked you one thing. One simple thing, bro. But we never know if Arvin will bring up another thing Sada is uh, responsible for. All right on. Have you seen this man? Where are you? Were you like homies back in the day? What the frick? Where is he? Are you? The sucker was roaming just now. Arvin! Arvin, I require assistance, Arvin! Arvin, I will jump! Arvin, I will freaking jump! What town is this down here? What the heck? Proto Mardarnir? There ain't even a gym here. It's a freaking vacation resort. A fairy den? Okay, I have to ask a question to you all. Was I the only one who saw that freaking Dawn fan? Or was that in my head? There's a freaking chance it was just in my head. The sucker's just not here. You know what, Dawn fan? F you. F you. Alright, I'll come back and... No, that's not the Dawn fan I seek. I will return to this sucker. And I will defeat you. Stop. We meet again, Dawns. Okay, I gotta buy more great balls, so let's sell some of our, our earnings. What do we got? Nugget? Oh. Y'all screwed up now. Man, I thought I had a lot more than all this stuff. But whatever. I can buy... 20... 22... 20... 21 great balls. Almost. A Taylor Swift song. But it wasn't. There's no, we have, some, someone needs to feel 21. This is a little ageist. Someone need to feel 23. Hold up a sec. Is no one feeling 24? Guess what I'm feeling. Twenty-five. Why'd it take you so long to answer that? Okay, uh, maybe... What the... Swablu, keep looking like a ghost. Maybe this is the way. Let's go dashing through the... Snow! Oh my god, this is the way. The freaking... Yes, ring the bell! Yes! You stupid Don fan! Almost had you! He dug a hole. Oh my goodness, Clavel. Beep. Some kid lucked out beating one of our sister squads. And now he thinks he can take us on. Time to give him the boot, gang. Let's show this Gatecrasher what Team Star can do. And if you're listening, Gatecrasher, know this. Unless you can beat 30 of our Pokemon in 10 minutes, our boss won't lift a finger to deal with the likes of you. Sir. Can you shut up? What the heck? Sableyes? I- Oh my god, I prepared freaking fighting types. Smart boys. Hey, where are you going? No. Oh my goodness. Where's Crydon? Um. Y'all included? There's no way y'all included. What the hell? Nimbles are dark types? No! I ref- This freaking tentacles ballerina dancing. Okay, this tentacle needs to evolve into a ballerina. It better not look like a freaking tentacle. I've never been so curious. To, st the, the, to see what this thing evolves into. I was super curious with the dig wiggle it. And I, it freaking blew my mind. I can't believe that's what it is. What the frick? Ponyard's right. He'll take you on. What you got to say? Nothing. What the heck? Oh, they're just Zorwas. Trust me, when you don't know the decks, everything looks weird to you. Those Zorwas look merged. That was like... It looked like a big monster. Okay, y'all handle that. 
How is the team doing? Everything's freaking cleaned up. Is that a ramp? I don't got no bikes. Want to send out some Pokemon. Handle him, Wug Trio. What the freak, man? It doesn't make sense. I don't, I, I don't understand. The, how is the den moving like that? There must be an explanation, right? I don't even mind it, man. Pokemon's supposed to be goofy. That's the thing. Think about it, man. Blastoise has cannons. Like, it's not, it's not that, you know, deep. Like, they just want to make badass some goofy Pokemon. Um, he's way above our level. We've got to get uh, the boss. Let's see this man come on. Let's see what kind of river broom he got. Okay, man, souped that up. Hit my river broom. So this thing's a dark type. Let's see my man. He's DJ. He's, he's producing. Hey, you need a beat? My name's Giacomo. Giacomo. Join. Yo. Why the frick can't Clavel do anything? You've done a real number on us, party crasher. Damn, was it? I'm Giacomo. At the deck, I go by DJ Vice. Call me whichever. I ain't calling you DJ Vice. It's a vibe either way. Nice to meet you and all. But how about we skip straight to your outro? Oh my god, no, Moon, please. Moon, I need you here. This weirdo's in front of me. Don't worry, I'll play you a sick requiem as you crash and burn. Let's get this party started. Get the granny. Get the turning up granny. This is a this is a good theme right here. The freaking guitar go crazy. You are so cool until. Put the MacBook Star down. No, not freaking pantsless. Don't think. You don't really think things through, do you? Declaring war on Team Star is a real bad move. Oh my goodness. Um, okay, let's mud shot the Ponyard. I wonder what type this car is. Are you dumb? Stupid? Okay, I saw you the first time, but I was ignoring you. So don't remind me. What the frick? This is your fault, battery. Who the frick? Is that a tree? <laughs> How's that for an opening track? I'll spin you up, party crasher. What freaking you you got the, the squid inkling girls in this too? The squids what do you call them? The squiddles. Freaking cheek me. Look at this creature. Why is it zoom? Stop panning up, cheek me. Damn, cheek me, rise like Jesus. Let's go. Oh my frick, this is amazing. Okay. Um, what can cheek me do? I can't thunder wave the boss Pokemon, right? So what do I want to do? I guess I'll uh, we'll just keep it simple. I'll, I'll use cheek me. I'll try to thunder wave anyway. So they soup up their car, and they ended up getting like different typed versions. Cause the other one was fire. This one's gonna be dark. I'm assuming. Look at this part of the song. Oh yeah, he, he made this. You river broom me up, river broom. Oh, he sends it out without warning me. Time to up the tempo. This show ain't over yet. Let's go, river broom. So sick. This one has intimidate. That's the exact ability I didn't want you to have. Okay, I want to try thunder waving you. I have to try. He's level twenty. I freaking did everything out of order. Melo was 26. Okay, it doesn't affect them. It's so weird. It's because they're the boss. Okay. I'm just going to arm thrust them anyway. No wonder uh, Melo was that hard. 
But even this guy, if he's the first one... Chronologically, he's just still a freaking level 20. Okay, I just need you to kill my Pommy. Pommy's not here to do much. I mean, cheek me. Like, he hasn't fallen off yet. He hasn't broken his laptop. Yeah, he's... Okay, yeah. Do that a bit more. Cheek me. We have, we have our lives to live. Cheek me. Just get all five strikes done. Okay, I didn't mean it like that. Cheek me. Okay, well... This is goodbye. Now why? I know exactly. We go into Rogers. Rogers got this. You're in charge, Rogers. You're in charge. Play rough. Metal sound? Oh, they have similar moves. Mela's had Screech. What is your equivalent? You know the move? Impact... Torque... Torque Blaze or something. What just happened? I used Play Rough! Did it just say not effective? Wait, no, no, no. I need to see that again. Oh, you're avoiding it! How are you avoiding it? You're giant! That makes no sense. Damn, what if they introduced a mechanic in Pokemon? Where if you were slower, like, at moves can hit you better. Through bad accuracy. That'd be kind of crazy. I mean, I wouldn't want that. There's some realism we don't need. <laughs> but it's kind of cool. <laughs> yeah, I was, I was listening very intently to the music he produced. His car just crashes. That's amazing. He got real emotional with some parts. Guess that's that. That's what he looks like. He looks like Guzma. Not that he is. He just looks like him for some reason. <laughs> Not that he is. I feel like I always gotta clarify. Oh my god. Okay. The story continues. Just an innocent producer. Guess that's that. Okay. It's reminding him. That's when he said it then. What's up, Giacomo? Did something happen? Alright, that lady. Frick. The one that scares me is the freaking kid. The big boss just wanted my take on some stuff. So we had a chat and settled on a few plans. A few plans? Like, for what? Operation Star, first of all. And also, a new code of conduct for the team. You know how tons of new members have joined up recently? We figure we gotta make some team rules like a code so we'll all be on the same page. Nice, you'll come up with a great code for us, won't you, Giacomo? Ha, no thanks. Way too much pressure. I mean, yeah. Wait a minute, bro. These guys are all good students. She took care of the freaking Sarah Luge baby. This man used to be president. You don't become president without reason. I mean, yeah, I used to be president of the school council. But you know, everyone ended up hating me after that, right? Of course we know. You forced a ton of stuffy rules on everyone and they wouldn't take it. We got some other nerd to replace you after like five minutes. <laughs> it's Nimona. I can't help but concur. Male student's hair must strain no further than 1.8 inches below the nape and so forth. Alright, you dumb, bro. You made that rule. Look at your freaking hair. What, is the loophole you freaking just comb it up? Your rules were vexation made manifest. My point exactly. So you'll all agree that I shouldn't be let anywhere near this new code. But you always know what's best for the team, Giacomo. You look out for us. You've earned our trust many times over. Without you, Team Star just wouldn't work. That stuck-up student council press isn't who you are anymore, man. A code written by the Giacomo I'm looking at now, I'd follow that any day. As would I. Okay, okay, thanks for the ego boost, everyone. I'll do it. I'll write the darn code. I did the best I could. I wrote that code myself, and there's no going back on it now. My days as a boss are over. So here, take my star badge, would ya? What's the point of this? What's the point of having to give your badge when you lose? Let's take a selfie! 
<laughs> Why do we shake hands? I don't understand this. We're not friends. Pokeball headphones. <laughs> We're not friends. I, mean, I would love to be, but I know you hate me. I'll give you this choice TM too. You earned it fair and square. Foul play. You didn't play very foul though. Okay. Ha, so this is how the party ends. But let's talk about those Pokemon of yours. They're crazy strong, huh? You learned those trainer chops at the academy? Like what moves you should use and stuff? Wow, this man does not seem like a bad guy. Don't say nope, sure did. Huh, okay. You like it at the academy? Having fun? Well, I don't know what to say, because if I'm having fun, he's going to feel like the new Prez is doing much better than him. Uh, I'm enjoying it. No kidding. Sorry to interrupt, but are you Giacomo? Whoa, I wasn't expecting a giant pompadour to make a guest appearance today. You get a Quaxwell. Oh my frick. Who's that? Quaxley's final? You get a... Quaxley's... They, they take care of their hair. You get a Quaxwell to style it up for you? I'm just after a quick word. Would you mind? Sure, I can tell it's gonna be something annoying, but I guess I'm newly freed up for time. Thanks, I'll get straight to it. It seems all of you in Team Star are headed for expulsion if you keep up your current activities. So why won't you break up the team and start attending class at the academy again? That's what you want to know? As it happens, we're actually waiting on a pal. Though we don't know if they'll be coming back. A pal? A close friend of yours, are they? They're only the strongest boss in all of Team Star. Like how there's a top champion who's the absolute number one trainer. Okay. The boss of Team Star. That's the person you talked to earlier. They're the one who invited us other bosses to form the team. We call him the Big Boss. And where is this Big Boss of yours now? Wouldn't we like to know? We haven't heard from him in Duno. Must be a year and a half now. That's the last time he's ever heard anything. When he spoke just now that they have to make the code. Last we heard of it. Of M. Okay, we don't know if it's a girl or boy. We thought that if we kept Team Star going, then they'd get back in touch one day. But the teachers kept pressing us to call it quits. And then we get party crashers like you two. Maybe the big boss did ditch us. They were talking about breaking up the team before and all. So Team Star and this big boss of yours, they're really important to you. Heh, <laughs> is the sky blue? Let me put in words you eggheads at the academy might understand. Hmm, they're my greatest treasure. That man is sick. I like that dude. That man is freaking sick. I like that line. Oh my goodness. Clive, can you do something? The big boss. I'm trying to think like Casanova. Are you the big boss? You, they, they got ditched. <gasps> Maybe Casanova wants them going back to school so they hired me to beat them all up and get them back to school that'll make a sense is it possible it might be possible they got ditched a year and a half ago this is where the first the, 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 the two characters flashbacks took place mela and giacomo it's probably Gio. okay I, i'm i'm mispronouncing it on purpose not that i know the real one rotototo how unexpected a phone call Damo, it's me. I take it that Giacomo Star Badge is now in your possession? I see. With its boss out of the picture, the second squad is pretty much done for. She's the leader! This is Giacomo. She left a freaking year and a half ago. There's some reason she left. It's her. That's the boss. This is the boss on the phone. I don't know why they got me breaking up Team Star. And you know, it, no, the timing is actually perfect. They want, they, the, the boss knows they're good people and wants them back going to school. I think the boss might be evil. Like, this person on the phone could be evil and have like a, a big plan, but they care so much about the Team Star bosses that they just want them going back to school while they handle, you know, what they want to do. Because this timing is as, as if they know that they're about to be expelled. I need to force them back to school.
Hmm. Now, about your reward. I'll transfer some LP. You know, the only thing I don't understand is, like, why doesn't, like, an Elite Four member just take out Team Star, right? Because Elite... It's not even, like, the school is so... It's, like, a small part of the region. Like, or an unnoticed part of the region. Even an Elite Four teaches there. So couldn't he just... I guess maybe the Elite Four just... They don't want to interfere or something. I'll have my supply rep. Okay, is it freaking Penny again? I am the supply rep. Do you do anything? You're still working for Team Star. That's the boss. It's me, the supply unit. Eat her. What, what the heck? Hey, stop that. Somebody help! What's happened? <laughs> what the frick? The credits just roll. Oh, look at... It drooled all over me. What even is that Pokemon anyway? I have no idea. <laughs> what the frick, Rockruff? Huh, I'm amazed you're so calm with the giant question mark of a Pokemon at your side. Uh, um, before I forget, here's your reward. That's it? Um, your name's Thamo, right? Since you're part of Operation Starfall's battle unit, can I ask you something? What do you think of Team Star? They're pretty strong. Interesting. You know, some of the rumors say Team Star weren't always a bunch of delinquents. Oh! They were the ones bullied. Now who the frick is the bully? Most of them used to be victims of bullying or just found it hard to interact with people. Okay, okay. But then these misfits and outsiders found each other and banded together to form Team Star. All they wanted was to push back against the bullies they couldn't face alone. But uh, that's just info I got by hacking other students' social media accounts. What? What, are, what am I playing right now? I also... <laughs> you... Uh... I also found talk about some secret mastermind behind the five bosses, someone who's recruited them to the team in the first place. Hmm. I don't normally talk this much, now my throat kinda hurts. Okay, she's not Casanova. So, um, good luck with taking down the other bases and stuff. Who is Casanova? You defeated a Sabla. Alright, that's a good point, guys. I'ma call it quits here. Go on and shank that like button. We are slowly finishing the map. Next episode, we'll check out the freaking Dawn fan. See what the explanation for it is. I'm telling you, Sada is up to something. I'm telling you, the boss is Casanova. Wait, the boss would have to be a student. This is a student organization. If they were up to something super evil, what could that be? Okay, anyhow. Uh, 4K likes, guys. We upload this again. I'll see you in the next video. Take care. Bitch, I'm the man.